Question number 17. Three different numbers add up to 40, and they have got to be different. The numbers have got to all be even, and each number must be less than 20. So write what the three different numbers could be. So mystery number plus mystery number plus mystery number equals 40. Best thing to do first is to actually write down what numbers I could possibly be using. So they've all got to be even and they've all got to be less than 20. So why don't I write down all the even numbers less than 20? So that could be 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18. Oh, I was going to write 20, but I can't do that because it's got to be less than 20. So I can't include 20. So I've actually only got these to deal with. Okay. Now then, what else can we do? Well, if I actually start with a really small number like 2, then that would leave me with needing to make 38 to get this up to 40. And there'd be no way of choosing two numbers from here to make 38 because none of them are big enough. 18 and 16, even if I choose the other two big ones, it does not make 38. It makes 34. So... 2 is not going to work, so I might as well eliminate 2 straight away. What about 4? Well, if I try 4, then I'd have to find 36 from somewhere. And I've just said that the other two numbers, big numbers, 16 and 18 makes 34, and that's too small for 36 that I need. So actually, I can eliminate 4. So now I'm down to only 7 numbers. Now, before we do any more, I think it's worth pointing out that there are more, there is more than one answer to this, okay? So, we'll try and look at a few different answers. So, I could, another good strategy would be to try and get as close to 40 as possible with my first number. And that would obviously mean using the biggest number. So, I could put 18 in there. Now, what would I need to add on to 18 to get me up to 40? I'd need an extra 22. So, provided that these two numbers make 22, it would work. So, what pairs of numbers have I got that make 22? Well, I can see that 10 and 12 makes 22. So, that would work. So, 18 and 10 is 28, plus 12 is 40. So, that works. But, there are other combinations that would make 22 as well. So... How about 6 and 16? 6 and 16 is 22. So that would work. Is there anything else I could use? Well, start with 18 again. 14 and 8 also make 22. So I've got three combinations right there that would work. How about if I started with the 16? Well, if I had have started with 16, I would have needed another 24 to get me up to 40, because 16 and 24 makes 40. So do any of these numbers make 24 that's needed? Well, 10 and 14 makes 24. So 16 and 10 is 26, plus 14 would be 40, so that would work. Is there anything else that makes 24? Well, uh, 18 and 6 makes 24. So I could have 16 again at the start, and then 18 and 6 there. But actually, you can see I'm starting to repeat myself, because 16, 18, and 6 is the same as this second combination here, just in a different order. But that, basically, we've shown that there is more than one correct way of doing this. Okay, so... A little bit of clear thinking is what's necessary here, but it was a good idea to write down all the even numbers less than 20 at the start to narrow down what we can actually choose from. Notice that it does say they've got to be three different numbers, so what you can't do is start repeating yourself here because that's not going to work. They would not be different. Hope that helps.